this is normal for the Mala This Rabbit. This is definitely DP favored. I, I think she can take the, the fire shield off fairly easily with a couple of levels in Spirit Siphon. And like Ember's biggest strength in the lane right now is the Sleight of Fist. It's, it's all about sitting there and harassing your opponent down. As he's got to be a little careful here. Just have the tree and armor. Oh, that Spirit Siphon has a huge range. He almost killed him with that. Crypt Storm though, on cooldown, they didn't want to use it. Oh, he oh, got, we him. got him! <laughs> Dark Mago with a cheeky play, C Smell gets the first blood solo kill mid. Yeah, Schofield tried to do the same thing, Panda preventing him. Yeah. The battery saw Clock is very good at dealing with the shenanigans, and Varysol is done. In the bottom lane is Ector, who they're going on now. Blink Strike to slow him a little further. They're down with the trample, and because of Lucent Beam, they top him beast for a second. Whisper though wants to kill his ex teammate, but he won't get to him. A little bit of mercy. Hector survives, gets the tango, he's fine. Well, he's fine for now. Matthew, he sees a courier, he sees Hector, has to choose which one he's rather kill. Staying in the trees for now, but Hector is healing up a little bit too much. Uh, Whisper. Whisper wants to go for yeah, it, Yeah, he's man. not afraid of it, apparently. He's That's got the trample. trample. There's the smoke screen as well. There's a Lucent Beam ready now for Hector, but it might need to be a little bit too late. One more hit will do the trick. Whisper gets a kill. That's the second kill of the game, both for EG. Even with the tree, I think they were banking on the tree heal protecting the Luna, but their, their math was wrong. Okay, that Mago, he's stuck in the Sprout now. Luckily, the trains don't actually body block him. He's like on He doesn't have that little spirit. He's going to die too. The, the Remnant, sorry. Schofield tried to help him out, but Schofield might just be in trouble himself. He takes the Creep Wave instead. It's invisible, which means the Creeps are no longer aggroing to him. Now he figures out there's a Sentry nearby. With that tower against MP and DP, what do you do? The Prophets. Matthew brings the wave back. That actually is needed. Yeah. Oh, but now, Stinger's walking in. He's dead. They really want to defend the mid tower at any cost. Searing changed the avalanche though. Might get him a kill. They're trying to go for the supports first. Matthew a little bit too tanky. Panda's a target. He's actually going to aggro them away. And Panda might die for this, but he allows his teammates to survive. See Smile though. A little bit of no man's land. The him with the split earth. Here are the reinforcements. Dark Mago as well with the Searing Chains. Three cores versus one core. This is just not fair. Oh, that C Smile, he might have reinforcements with the help of Whisper. They get the kill of Mago. He is not going to die today. Matthew does, though, with one last smoke screen. Annoying the last track. Another split earth. He needs the target. He misses. Can he get it? He misses. That's huge for Sacred without the stuns. How will they stop the constant spam of the Crypt Swarms? He just has to run away while well, the Trim Protector helps him. Sakers one last hit away from dying, but he'll barely live. Stinger also manages to survive. No more mana for Sea Smile. I don't know what's going on, Abba. <laughs> I really don't. Whisper's trying to take a creep wave to farm it with a camp that he stacked earlier, yeah. but Sacred is making it impossible for him to do that. Oh, they're TPing in. Schofield's coming, dude. They're he... gonna fight this. Whisper has to get away. It's a long TP. It is. He's not gonna connect. He also has. Oh, he has arcade boots. He has enough mana for Avatars. Yeah. Whisper. Oh, Whisper's walking back in. There's a toss the back, but Whisper, he, is he not afraid of anything? Yes, because he has reinforcement, that's why. Mago nearby, the two supports though with Whisper. Smoke screen plus those cogs makes it difficult for the Ember to go anywhere. Like Mago's limited, useless right now. Finally out of the smoke screen, he can start using some spells. See Smile. Oh, into he the tower. wants to kill Schofield, but into the tower goes Matthew. Whisper tries to save Whisper's him, but he missed out too. As Splinter does help him. Uh, does, sorry, does hinder him as he tries to get away. Sea Smile will dive the tower instead. They're going for Sacred. Sacred healing back up thanks to the Magic Wand. Nice Another Earth reveals the trees now. They know where Sea Smile is, but he's just hurting them a little bit too much. And they get the kill on Sacred. His next target is the enemy mid laner. It's going to be that Mago. That Mago back to the tower. He's Dude. safe for now, but Whisper, how crazy is he? They give vision with the Rocket Flare. We still have. Oh, he almost dodged it. That Primal Beast. Whisper's gone. Onslaught. He goes. He got stopped by the Searing Chains. The kill's going to happen. That Mago gets it underneath the tower. The he Rocket's not fast oh, enough. I knew he's he back to fight. His Mago's not afraid. He wants to kill the DP, but Pen is a nuisance. He has to stop this, and he does, sacrificing his own life for his mid, for his, uh, mid laner there. Uh, somebody needs to tell these guys it's not a death match. <laughs> Primal Beast, he doesn't have his ult yet. They just want to fight. They, ha they have to win the fight. This is not about winning. This is about pride. Yes. It's about showing who is the stronger fighter. Yes. They want to show Matthew he is not it. Toss, Ava. He's dead. Dude. Luna, I mean, I think that's also a way to keep up with the Luna in terms of farm. Uh, just the Maelstrom will not keep up with Glaives on Luna, but Maelstrom oh. plus Midas will. Okay, Whisper's finally sick, so he's showing yeah. up here. Panda, he caught Hector. The smoke screen as well. Hector doesn't have any items to help him. He's gonna keep on fighting here. He's gonna die eventually with the help of Whisper as well. They got him. Stinger in the trees again. As uh, Sacred, by the way, is going for a Greaves build on Leshrac offlane, yeah. which I think is definitely the play for Leshrac offlane. A lot of people were going Bloodstone for a while when that was an OP item, but 
Griefs is just a better item now. Like, you need a hero with this in a game of Dota 2. And now found Panda. Hook shot, but this time he does get blocked. I think he tried to smoke there. Obviously, did not work out. Overgrowth, not going to happen. Primal Beast stops him. Sacred, oh, now gets a nice stun. double split Earth with a slide of Fist. They got the Remnant just in case. Matthew's nearby. They're going to surprise him with a smoke screen. They got to slow him somehow. He managed to get away from the smoke screen as Sacred re engages. The target is to go for Whisper oh, from behind. Sacred's been surprised. He's done. That Mago continues once again, not afraid of the high ground. He wants Whisper, but it's impossible. Remnant's away, but he's not safe. Panda caught him all away, and it's going to be Sting out to sacrifice himself for this so that Mago can finally live. A nice evasion of the onslaught as Stinger dies to the ghost here in the auto attacks. Oh, At once, Schofield. From Schofield, but Schofield's alone. He tried to get the kill on Whisper, but it's impossible. Slide of Fist won't oh, help either. Go. And the Mago no has help. He needs something else. It's going to be the Eclipse. Going for Smile next. But Hector, he's alone now. Everyone's dead. It's a Rampage for C Smile. They just fed him one by one, Jenkins. It's become a problem when he's got the DKB, the Sanjin Kaya. Like, this hero having an item lead is pretty beastly. Okay, Hookshot finds the tree protector in the trees with the Onslaught. <laughs> they even used the push from Cogs. Nice little extra damage, of course. Small kill, though. Sleeping Darts online. Nectar just trying to TP, but they do. Hey, have the Pulverize. <laughs> Luna now running away. What uh, are you going to do, Hector? You're he, done. He tries to Mask of Madness himself out, but that just kind of kills him quicker. And that's... Yeah, they are. They are. They've used a lot of buybacks this game. They're getting <laughs> a little excited to fight. They just... They just want to win the fights. Right. And uh, it's costing them. Like, this whole time, EG is not buying back, so... It means also the, the, the res timers are really long for Beast Coast, which means the fights are going even worse. Catching Matthew will be a good start to this fight, but once again, Tricks of the Trade prevents this death. Never mind. Slide of Fist was here. Secure it. Schofield's now being run down into the high ground. Whisper selects a better target. It's going to be Sacred with the Pulverize. Sacred's just stuck here, but heals back up. Has the mech. He's just going to come into Pakaz. Not enough damage. Sargmago, though, does not know the meaning of the word back. Kills a courier. And he kills the courier in process. He's learning from Matthew. Up to the high ground. He goes with Whisper. He predicted that perfectly. He knew where he was going in before Sargmago. Luckily for Sargmago, Whisper does not have any backup. He's going to keep chasing. He's got the Searing Chain soon. Yeah, but he's low on mana now, though. Also, yeah. never know when the dart is going to come out, right? I'm surprised how aggressively he's playing. There's no BKB yet. Yeah, he's acting like it, that's for sure. Hector is also acting like he's a BKB. He doesn't have one. That's Hurricane Pike. No he TP, also though. Has no TP. That is a Hector Classic right that there. That is a Hector Classic. I mean, he's not getting away. He's just a matter of time. No, this is just... But he is forcing a TP, at least. Nope, not even a TP completed. He forced nothing. Actually, he forced his support to maybe die for him. There's actually fights going on all over. Matthew might die for Stinger. So they commit a lot to the Ricky and they finally get him. As now, Ban Panda is happy to die for this. He just wants to get the cogs to make sure the Sacred can't get away. They already killed the care. They just need the off laner and the mid laner now. Like Mago's the first target. For now, though, Sacred might be too strong. Panda's down and they haven't been able to do anything to him. Schofield, your base is not that way, but this is normal for Schofield. There's the Yules. The Yule Scepter into the Sprout. He had Quelling Blade, but the Pulverize does not care about your Quelling, my friend. Yeah, that was a long range Pulverize. I'm not. <laughs> That's what they were saying in the beginning of the game, calling each other ugly. It was right. all about the primal exactly, beast. Exactly, exactly. I see. Sleeping dart for Dark Mago. Smoke screen on top of this. Again, no BKB for this man. And Whisper is almost going down mid. But look at this. He has a BKB, Jenkins. The difference this item makes, it's incredible. It's a good item. Yeah, yeah who would have thought? I mean, Whisper played it pretty close there. The insanity, though, that he actually finishes Maelstrom before thinking a BKB against a Ricky is... Goddamn mid laners, dude. Greedy bastards. Well, that's because the support is getting kills all over. Yeah, they need they, the nobody needs knowledge. it. That's right. There's so much fighting. Matthew has enough knowledge in his own dome. That's Schofield. Sprouted. I mean, yeah, Avalanche. Avalanche to tree, Schofield. Looking really bad for Beast Coast here. Locked in their triangle, and the triangle's not even a triangle anymore. It's two camps. Yeah, you keep mentioning it. It's alive. Because, I mean, he's, he doesn't have BKB. Okay, he does have BKB. No, he, he doesn't. Seems, it's on cooldown. Oh, okay, he has Glider, though. Fights against Stinger. Bakas will die for this. Mega kill for Pakaz, but they do get him in exchange. And now Sacred joins as well. Sacred can't deal with the enemy mid laner. He's going to fall. Like, Mao couldn't help him in time. This and now stuck in the smoke screen. There is no BKB. Hector's joining. But what can Hector do? He's hitting C Small. That's nice the right hook. target. The hook shots prevents him from leaving. Luckily, the Hurricane Pike will allow him to do so, though. As he didn't cogs in time, because they were on cooldown there for Panda. At least. Matthew he, almost diced the tower there. That was awkward. Yeah, yeah. Then it looks good. Yeah, it looks amazing. 
without it. Oh, Gleipnir, no. Hector, even underneath tower. Living armor, he has Proud, he has nothing to cut the trees with. To life His hurricane plank is on cooldown. Oh no, Hector, that top lane has been his damnation. They even cut the Weshrek here. Sure, grieves it up, but Sacred, they don't have enough HP to survive. Even with a hook shot, they're being greedy about this. They want Schofield, he has a four step himself. As the smoke screen, they catch that Mao Gleitner on top of this. He's still silenced because of the DP and because of the onslaught. He's dead. Now with Matthew fall, sorry, now with Schofield falling nearby, Beast Coast is once again crumbling like the tiny crumbled in front of them. Stinger smoked himself to get out of that. He just doesn't want to die. I thought maybe he was looking to go get wards down or something, but they got to look over for their KDA now, you know. <laughs> Still, there's no tier 2 that's fallen for the side of Beast Coast, so... I mean, yeah, but okay, there's one concern we can really get dressed, which is they still have a Luna. Right? They do have a Luna. This that's is the a, biggest problem they have. This is a dog shit hero, Avo, you're right. Sleep, Onslaught, smoke screen. Okay, that's going to help with the 4-staff, though. And that Milo is safely out. In fact, the counter initiation caught Matthew. Took to the trade, avoids the overgrowth, but Matthew is still gonna die to residual damage, it seems. Lightning Storm to finish him off. Panda barely lives there thanks to the Glimmer Cape. Like, oh, oh, wants him, but can't kill him. Pakaz, though, commits and he gets the kill onto Stinger. Hector might have gone a bit too far. He no longer has Hurricane Pike. Can someone help him? He activates Eclipse, but BKB ignores it. Whispers alone, though. So is. Okay, Boy, he, he smiles there. Hector needs to run away, but he's not fast enough to trample. Dude, that was pretty much a solo kill by Whisper there. He got turned into a pancake, Jenkins. It's it's the lack of BK going being here, which I can get behind. The man just loves Dota. It's his first time in Lima, actually. Yeah. Very excited. Really? No. Okay. He's from here. Oh. Everybody seems to be from here. They killed him. Oh, well, you were, you know, mistake ge I see. geographically mistake. You kill a 21k NP. 20 k uh, one k and a net worth MP. How do twice. you kill a 17k net worth DP as well? Yeah, that's Sacred. true. Sacred. See, oh, smile. He's easy. That dart was insane range. Onslaught. Over eyes. There we go. Bye bye, Schofield. We missed a really beautiful juke on the bike. Bike. Yeah, not bad. Okay, he's he has fine. He's BKB now too, uh, Jenkins. That's good. That's good. He's now safe. Uh, but Bakaz doesn't care about BKB. Bakaz is stunned for now. Are there any supports? Are there any help? Nope. They're just gonna let poor Sacred die here. What was Sacred doing if they were just going to let him die like that? Uh, I mean, you've got that on the map. I, I don't think you can just sit in the base, or at least it feels bad for you to sit out in the base. That's why Darkma goes top, and he's actually getting caught out by Matthew here. Yep. Picasso's Mostly. there. Light beer. where are you going, Darkmago? To the grave. I gotta say, this Ricky Nature's Prophet is loud until he gets the BKB. Because literally just TP's in front of the tier 3 to be efficient, conging him. Is for Schofield. Oh, they pull whip him. Panda might die for this. Onslaught. Here comes Whisper, at least to avenge his dead teammate. Getting the opposite five as well. They're creating space for Pakas to push, but now Whisper could be in trouble here. Activating the BKB. Where's the healing coming from? He doesn't have much, but apparently he's just too tanky. And Pakas keeps hitting. Now he eats the whole eclipse. That's going to get rid of his first life, but what about a second? Do they have a plan for that? Apparently not. He's just back here and now kills off Schofield. Going for Rax next. They know where Stinger is. They want to force the dieback, but they can't cut his trees just yet. There's the buyback as well from Schofield. Gleitnir finally catches Stinger. A dieback for him. Schofield also leasing the tree. Sleeping dart. Poor Schofield just can't move. And that Mago in the backline is creating space for him for some reason. He's just going to die. The GG is called. Beast Ghost is giving up.